I find it rather disgusting that there are still a number of people out there who equate fear with respect. Some of these people do this when it comes to the police. Some of these people do this when it comes to parenting. Heck, some of the people who do that when it comes to parenting think that it's okay to break your child's will in order for them to respect you. That's not respect. Those of you who think this sort of thing, you don't even know what respect actually is. It's kind of disgusting. We shouldn't have to have this attitude of, uh, Oh, please, officer. Please, officer, don't arrest me. Yes, Amasa. Yes, Amasa. If we're pulled over. We should be able to talk with the person like a regular person. Police officers are supposed to be there to serve and protect us. They're supposed to de-escalate situations, but that's not what they've been doing lately. They've been escalating situations, purposely escalating situations. And for those who are saying, well, no, they're not purposely doing it. Okay, fine. They are purposely going out of their way to make sure that they have power over other people instead of looking at other people as equals. Yes, they're in a position of power, but that doesn't mean they should be abusing that power. And when they expect people to cower in their presence, that's abusing their power. If you see a police officer in a store, you shouldn't have even the slightest glimmer of fear that they might accuse you of something. But most of us do. Most of us do have that fear. We associate police with fear. And that's not the way it's supposed to be. If you're going to just argue, well, that's the way things are and you have to accept it, I, I just, I don't know what to tell you. It's sad that that's what you think that we should be living like. Police are supposed to be there to protect and serve. Now, I know not to, to get all flippant and give police officers a bunch of really nasty attitude. But if I'm pulled over for something, I will, I will ask them questions. I learned in my 20s that the reality is, if you give them attitude, they're going to make your life hell. They should be treating people like the way customer service representatives treat people. But they don't do that. Again, instead of de-escalating situations, they seem to be experts now in escalating them. And it's supposedly up to us now to de-escalate the situations. That's not the way it's supposed to be.